Now we come to the part you've all been waiting for. Yes, it's the Ask Feld. We've been combing Twitter and taking in all of your comments and emails for good questions and truly questions, and we're going to do our best to answer a couple of them each time. So, I have Ace Podcaster Martin Griffin here to read out those questions from off camera in that wonderful silky podcasty voice he's got. So, tell me, what do we got for our first question? Michael asks, what can we do to make Comcast management realize that they have to have their customer service representatives actually treat their customers better? Great question. We need to make a lot of noise. And it can't be noise that doesn't mean anything like, oh yeah, well I'm going to quit because that laughter you hear at the other end of the sound of the uh, phone is some poor oppressed worker saying, yeah, nice try. We know you don't have a choice. That's why you're with us in the first place. You make noise to your member of Congress. You make noise to your state local franchising authority. You make noise to your local state delegate. You make noise to the Federal Communications Commission. Why? Because there actually are laws on the books or the threat of laws on the books that will let you get a hook into these guys. Nora asks, do you believe the Trans-Pacific Partnership or TPP is a serious danger to free communication. And if so, what can we do if it passes and becomes a binding treaty to protect that communication from it as much as possible? I think there's a lot in the Trans-Pacific Partnership that we need to be worried about. I think in the first instance, it's very important for anybody who cares to be calling up their member of Congress right now and saying, no, I don't want that fast track authority, not unless they make TPP open and take out some of the crazy stuff that they got in there in the intellectual property parts. Second thing we can do is if it does go through, then we got us a fight on our hands. and. I always hate fighting a rear guard action rather than stop it in the first place. So let's try to stop it in the first place and then if we lose on that, we'll figure out what we ought to be doing next. 